What's up guys and welcome back to Super Mario Run and today we're going to be continuing on with our adventure in the world tour by tackling world 5, the second to last world. But before we do of course, I want to go ahead and buy yet another character. Now of course we have quite a lot of coins as you can see and quite a lot of toads unlocked. I've been making a good chunk of progress there. But we're going to go ahead and buy Toadette today. The house where Toadette lives, places and Toadette will join. Very, very, very cool. I was going to say... Also, I don't know what I was gonna say, but now I don't need to worry about it because we can now play as Toadette, which is great. <laughs> so um, when it comes to these other characters, we'll worry about them whenever we can, but there is a new bridge that I guess I'll buy because I have no idea where it leads. Like we already got left, right, up and down. We're not up, but we got left, right, and down. But now we can go down and right, which is pretty cool. The kingdom has expanded, keep building your blah, blah, blah. You know, you know. Now what about the next rainbow? I know there's a new special thing in stock. What could it be? It is another rainbow. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get that one too. And where is this one gonna lead? To the left now. I mean, you have a lot of space for all this stuff that I don't know how I'm gonna make enough room for it all. Like, that just sort of seems pretty weird. Another special building's in stock. Okay, what is it now? Oh, I don't know. I don't see anything new. Um, yeah, I have no idea what it's talking about then. Either way, I think that's where we're gonna um, finish it off with buying things. Now we're gonna go into the world tour. As you can see, the gold Goomba event is going on right now. We'll run into the one in world five, but beyond that, I'm not gonna worry about it too much right now. You can see there's a stamp card, and if you fill up enough stamps, you can go ahead and just um, get awesome stuff for it, which is pretty cool, but I'm not gonna worry about it for right now. Like I said, for right now, we're gonna go ahead and play as Toadette, which is right here. Her pink pigtail set her apart from the other toads. She's also a referee for Toad Rally. So I guess she controls exactly like Toad does? I can only assume? I don't know, I guess we'll find out. But right now, let's go into World 5-1 Lackey 2's Revenge, which I'm not looking forward to because Lackey 2's are not fun to go against at all, in any sense of the word. So let's get started, have some fun. Is she faster? I think so. Okay, this is really loud. Why is it always so loud all of a sudden? I was, uh, did I, wait. Did I just pass a pink coin? No, I don't think so. But I did miss a star, which is going to be an issue. But hey, there's another one. <laughs> okay, is this just like constant stars? I mean, because I don't mind. Uh-oh, is it down there? I hope it's not down there. <gasps> oh, it's down there. Um. Oh, there we go, I got it. Okay, so I've gotten most of the pink coins so far. Didn't notice that until the last second. <laughs> that was scary. Oh no, my star! I need to get that. I need to get that before it goes away. I need to get that before, it I think it went away. Oh no, I'm in some deep trouble. Unless I can get this one. No, there was no star in that one. No, oh no, get it. Yeah, okay, it was a, it was a star, good, good, good. It's all just about getting stars here, which I like. But there you go, there's all the pink coins. Oh my gosh, very intense, very crazy. But we did it without too much of an issue. I like it, very good. <laughs> Okay, so there's our first level there with Toadette. Not too bad. I really can't tell if she controls like normal Toad or not, but I'm gonna assume so. 100,000 coins is a lot of coins, by the way. It's taken me a lot of time to earn all of that up. And I mean, we bought Toadette. We still had over 100,000, which is pretty cool. I mean, unless we just gained over, you know, it doesn't matter. We have over 100,000 now. And two more tickets, which I don't need. <laughs> I have 92 of them, or 93. Uh, let's go into 5-2, which is gonna be Pokey, or yeah, is it Pokey? Pokey Vaulting. Let's go. Oh boy. I hope you guys have still been enjoying the series, by the way. The series has been doing well. You guys are like a thousand people at the least check out every episode, which is pretty cool for, you know, a game that's technically been out for a while on other devices. So, just wanna say thank you. Oh boy. Let's do what we can here. Um, I'm gonna do that, and that worked out pretty well. That was dumb of me. But I did get the pink coin. So I will not complain. <laughs> okay, um, but yeah, it was, that was just a matter of not awful timing. Unfortunately, I did not have not awful timing. But you know what, I wanna talk about Mario today. The Nintendo Switch has been out for a, a little bit more than a month now. You know, March 3rd, it's like April 4th as of recording this, who knows when it's going to go out. But um, um, at the end of this month, the end of April, there's gonna be the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, and I just wanna confirm, I will be playing the ever-loving heck out of that game because I love Mario Kart. It's one of my favorite like game series of all time. Like, just karting genre is one of my favorite. Well, I'm gonna go down here because I have a feeling there's gonna be some sneaky stuff, and there was indeed some sneaky stuff. I like it. Um, but yeah, 
expect, oh gosh, me to play some Mario Kart 8 a ton. Some people are saying, will I play with viewers? That'll be the goal. Oh, I messed it up. But hey, I got some extra coins for getting the Koopas in the shot. Um, I will probably be playing with viewers. It depends on how many people are interested. Like, you know, if there's not a huge amount of people interested in seeing me play Mario Kart 8, I'll probably just play through the game single player and move on. But if like, you know, the series is really well and tons of people wanna play with me, I'll definitely stream it and try to play it with you guys. You know, it's just sort of, you know, supply and demand as always. Um, beyond that, of course, I'll be playing the new Mario game at the end of the year. That looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun. I can't wait to try it out. I don't know if there's gonna be any other Mario games releasing. World 5-3 behind lock and key. I do wanna do a Mario game over the summer. And the Mario game I wanna do over the summer is for the Wii U, it's the 3D Land World 3D Wii U version. I don't know what it's called because I've never really played it, but it looks like a blast, so I want to. Okay, what's gonna be up here? A mushroom, a shroom of mush. Good, Oh, got the key, got a key, that's good. No, okay, is there something down here? I mean, I guess there wasn't anything on the bottom floor there. These areas always freak me out because I'm like, oh gosh, am I gonna be able to find the uh, the pink coin? Right here, though, here's one. Um, I don't know how to get this one. Oh, just like that. But how did I miss the first one already? No, wait, there's, a, there's one pink coin I've missed somewhere in this. How? How in the world? How did I miss it? I didn't see anything. Hmm. Well, maybe I, ah, oh, no! Toadette, come on. This is super tough. I don't like how super tough this is because these guys sort of like have a long period of time before they pop out. So it's, it's hard, it's really hard to predict. That is, this is tough. So here's a weird tidbit of information. Apparently if you backflip onto a boo, it will destroy the boo. I had no clue. It rhymes, but beyond that, it's just confusing. I had no idea that that would happen. Like, that's just really weird. I actually had to look that up because it was just confusing me. Um, but now I know, for better or for worse. Let me get over here, and then, oh, oh no. Um, how do I wanna get this? I think I wanna go ahead and jump like that, and I died. Okay, so I need to find the key somewhere. I'm gonna assume, oh boy. It's gonna be in like this block over there. Now getting that block might be a bit difficult. Like I'm gonna assume that I have to go like this and then what? What game? Okay, that one I'm gonna argue to my last breath because that was ridiculous. Um, But go like this. There it is, there it is. Oh, no wait, 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 <laughs> come on. Oh, I, I really hate boo houses. Like, like, I think that's like the top three for me that I hate the most out of Mario levels. It's number one, I hate water levels. Number two, I hate boo houses. Number three, I hate desert themed levels in Mario games. It's just sort of the, the pecking order. Oh, more time. I really needed that thank you game. At least it gave me more time, you know? If, if it's gonna give me anything, it might as, whoa! Okay, well be that. Okay, there's another boo with the pink coin here. So I gotta be careful. Wop. Hold on, hold on. Wop, yeah, what? Why is it not work that time? Are you kidding me? I don't understand this game sometimes. <sighs> there we go, okay, come on, come on. Pick that up, and we somehow got all the pink coins, and oh, I almost got hit by that boo, and I would've been so done. We did it! Okay, I don't care, even if we complete this level, it's still like my least favorite level so far. I jumped there, I don't care. We completed the level with all the pink coins, which is all that matters. Jeez, not pleasant. I really don't like that, you know, that, oh yeah, you can backflip over booze now, and that destroys them. And we never told you that before, but now you know. I don't like that one bet. I wish it could have just like made something that was more obvious to figure it out. And once I figure it out, it's like, I guess it is that if you're, you can backflip over booze, but you need to go over them, or your legs need to touch them. It's oddly specific. But either way, we're going into the 5-4 tower, Rings of Fire. Let's go. All right, we're going down to the Ring of Fire and I instantly messed it up. You know it's gonna be a good run when you instantly mess it up. Oh boy. Okay, so we can go through these Rings of Fire and they don't actually do too much for us. And I'm guessing if we mess up our angling, that won't be so pretty. Okay, well, what? Okay, I thought like the game was pulling some shenanigans on me. Oh, so this guy goes all the way up and all the way down. Well. You know what? I think I might as well die here in a second. Um, whenever chance I get, I guess. 
I got all those, which is nice, but this doesn't matter, you know? <laughs> I really don't want to be able to do it if I'm missing the pink coin, so I'm gonna redo it. Okay, so we're going through a ring of fire now. Okay, there we go, that was a good start. That was a good start. I gotta wait for the pause, though. So it looks like going through the ring of fire itself doesn't actually do anything for you, which is interesting. Ooh, what? Did I, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Not happening that way. Oh geez, this is tough to aim up. No, if I can't do it, it won't happen. I'm telling you that much. I will dry, I'll turn this toadette around. This vacation, which is not a vacation, will end sooner than you think. I'm trying to be a stern zebra right now. It's, it's not really working. Super Mario Run is not phased by my sternness. Okay, I barely got that. Barely. Okay, I almost have all the pink coins already, which I will not complain about. You know, bring bring on Bowser if I have star power. I wonder if there is actually a point in this game. Oh no. Come on, bada boom. All right, all pink coins gotten. Oh no. But I still need to get to the end. Oh, hi Bowser. Hi Bowsy Bows. How you doing? Okay. Are you ready, Toadette? Oh, I wasn't ready either, to be honest with you. I don't think Toadette can jump that high. Oh man, going, oh. There's no ducking in this game. <laughs> oh, nice. <gasps> I did it! I, okay, I'll take it. I will take it. You know those people who are always like, I don't play Nintendo games because those are easy and for babies. I bet you they couldn't play this. This is so tough. I don't know, most Nintendo games are actually really stinking difficult, so it's weird that they get that rep of being easy baby games. But I got a ticket. I mean, maybe it's because I'm playing as a pink, cute little mushroom girl, which, I mean, you know what? It can be the pinkest, cutest mushroom girl. This game can be tough as nails sometimes. So if you think you're a pro elite gamer, buy some Super Mario Run and shut me up and play well. You can probably do it better than I can. But 90, I mean, I don't think you'd be watching this series if you thought that kind of stuff. Courses from a new world have been added to the tutorial. Amazing, which means in the next episode, we will be tackling world six. We don't have to worry about it for right now because we're gonna go ahead and tackle some toad rally as Toadetta, yes. Um, for at least a little bit, but then I might get sick of it and turn to, you know, Mario as I always do. As you can see, we're level 3765. Actually, before I do that, I should go against viewers because that's always fun to do. Okay then, so I have like three pages worth of friends, so it's hard to know who to go against. You know, just because there's so many of them. Uh, for right now, you know what? I gotta go against the Zebra King. Well, let's settle this. Who is the king of zebras right now? Me or the Zebra King? I'm pretty sure I am. But I don't know, we're gonna have to find out. <laughs> I don't know if this person's named the Zebra King by coincidence or because they're such a fan of my videos that they named themselves the Zebra King. We'll find out. I'm playing as Toadette, so you know what? If I lose, I blame, I blame that. And not that I'm not the Zebra King, because I think I am just the king of the junk. You know what? And there's no higher rank than that, right? <laughs> I hope so. I don't even remember ever playing this level before, but we are neck and neck. You know, like, great zebras think alike, you know? So, not too surprising so far. Oh, I'm sliding. Oh no, how do you have your star power already? Okay, somebody has to teach me their secrets because I am not sure. I probably shouldn't be following their every move, though, if they're ahead of me. Because that just means they're gonna do one better than I will. Whoa, whoa, game freezing up on me. There you go, more excuses. The game is freezing up on me. Oh boy, whoa, 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 no. All right, plop up there, and then keep going. Come on, don't stop, no matter what. Even if I'm losing, I gotta keep my hopes high. Wow, that was a lot of coins. Come on, give me a star. Oh, the triple star, this could be my chance to catch up. Oh boy. Okay, come on, come on, come on. I actually need to get things to pick up though, game. Come on now, give me coins. Anything, really. Oh, and I caught up. How's that feel? Okay, come on, coin, 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 coin. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, come on. Ah, oh, I couldn't get to that last coin block. I probably lost, but I'm still the king of zebras. I'm still the king, just because I'm not good at Super Mario Run, doesn't mean anything, right? Yeah. <laughs> you are way too good at that, man. I can't even come close. All right, we'll go ahead and do at least one more friendly rally. We'll see who else we can go against. Uh, it takes a while to load because there's a lot of friends. Like, look at the three page. We'll go to, to help out some people in the back here. We'll go ahead and we'll go against somebody like way back here because I'm sure like everybody who adds me wants me to go against them, right? So let's go against 
somebody in the back. Just because I don't want to like only go against the people on the front page because that just doesn't feel like it's fair. So against this person, Pochi. Hope I pronounced it correctly. And we'll see what we can do. Maybe we'll do better. Maybe we'll do worse. The only problem is that I don't gain any toads for this, which I understand why, but it also makes it quite tough because, um, what's it called? You know, I want to be able to earn up toads, you know, to continue in the series. Well, I guess I'm not getting that pink coin. Oh well. I think I'll be able to survive. What? What? Okay, that's not what I wanted. But whatever. Oh, mushroom? Okay, mushroom's not bad. Now, some people were telling me, of course, I shouldn't bother getting the pink coins because, you know, they, I don't need them to win. But the thing is, is that if you get a pink coin, it, it counts as an automatic cheer. And there's actually been a few rounds I've won just off of cheers. Like, I was behind on coins, but I got more toad cheers, so I actually won, which was pretty crazy. So I try to pick up pink coins when I can, and it seems like if I take the route that gives me pink coins, it usually works out better for me. So that's my focus for the most part. Let's go ahead and boom. Ah, oh, just coins. But hey, coins aren't too bad. Alrighty, boom. Go, go, go. Get up here. And what is this gonna give me? Some stuff, some stuff. Sometimes even like bricks will hide pink coins, which is pretty nice. Hmm. Oh, let's get up here. Pink coin, yeah, there we go. And it also counts as a coin at the least, so it's like, it's sort of a win-win. You get an extra coin and you get an extra cheer for it, so I don't think it's all that bad of an idea. But there we go, we have gotten more stuff done, and that's 340 coins for us, but that was good. Pochi had a lower toad score, so I'm guessing that they're newer to the game, so I don't think they did bad at all. All right then, so let's go to our kingdom now and get like two toad rallies done, and maybe that's where we'll call it a day. Maybe we'll do a little bit more, I'm not really sure. Let's go ahead though and rally it up. I need to tackle green and blue toads, because right now my focus is getting that cake. I don't know why, but I want it. And for the cake, I need 2,000 red toads, 1,000 blue, 1,000 green, 500 purple, 500 yellow. So I've gotten the purple and yellow. I focused on them first because I knew they'd be the most difficult. So now I'm focusing on blue and green. You can see I'm making some great progress with green, so I'll probably keep on focusing on that today. But you can see there is some decent blue and green levels that feature both of them. And all levels feature red toads, so I'm not even worrying about that one. That one's sort of getting up naturally. But there are all red toad levels, so if I ever want to, I can do that one and hopefully win a few. But I've noticed that I've, I win the, the red, red, green, green, green. And I win this one, which is a red, green, green, red, blue or something. Oh, yeah. As you can see, like I said, I am a winner. I'm gonna hide the other character's preview, though. If I'm not playing with friends, I'm gonna hide it. Because I notice that I get confused a lot with the other thing, and I also just feel pressure. So if I hide it, it usually makes it easier for me. If it makes it less intensive a viewing, a viewing experience, let me know and maybe I'll change it again. But for right now, I'll keep it like this. I gotta say, Toadette's not my ch character of choice so far. She's not bad. Whoa, just not my character of choice. So definitely some new stuff being featured here because it's a Toad Rally. Um, And we haven't played these levels previously. Oh boy. Oh gosh. But we didn't, like, we haven't played, like, the firing aspect of a level before um, this episode, so I haven't seen those in a Toad Rally yet, so that's weird. Okay, okay, Toadette? What the heck, Toadette? What is, I am so done with Toadette. Like, after this, we are playing around as Mario because it just works out so much better for me. It always does. If I play Toad Rally with anybody but Mario, I always regret it. And then I lose my Toad score and I gotta earn it back up as Mario. So I might as well stick with Mario. I definitely lost. Oh, no, I'm not getting that. She jumps pretty high, but it's like, what's the point of jumping high if all you're gonna jump into is spinning buzzsaw blades, you know? Doesn't really help me too much, and I definitely lost. Oh boy. Yeah, I definitely lost. Can I, ch I don't think I can choose which character I play as when I rematch, so I'm just gonna go ahead and move on. Okay, so I usually do pretty good with this level, which means I'm gonna do awful. Because I said that I usually do pretty well. But I think I usually find my jam with this one, and it's usually not too bad, so I'll give it a shot. Hopefully things will work out. Hmm, there, get that. Plop down there, yep. I always like getting that one, because this is a free little bit of coins, and here's the red coins. If I mess this up, this run is probably done for. Oh, I got it, don't worry. It's in the bag. Okay, and we get another, okay, another one. Okay, oh, and I missed it. Oh, geez, because I couldn't land on the guy because I instantly destroy him. Ooh, but I did get that first, which is good, right? 
that's nice to know. Let's go ahead and get that. I feel like my star power should have lasted longer if I didn't mess up getting the second one, which I don't know why there was a second one. It's sort of weird. I've, like, I don't know. I don't think I've seen that kind of spawn before. But uh, whatever. I'm just gonna, oh, here's another one. Wow, they give you a lot this level. Okay, come on. No, I messed it up again, I'm the worst. Oh no, they gave me another one again. Okay, whop, whop, yeah, okay, I got that one. I got three seconds left though, so I don't know if I can really make too much of it. Oh, I got the pink coin right at the end. I made it much farther than the other person. I noticed that they got a flagpole significantly later than I did. So I'm gonna hope I won. I really, really hope I won. I won, so there we go. We got a lot of losses, a few wins. Not too bad at the end of the day. We got more green toads, which is what I wanted. How many green toads did we get out of that? Because there's two red toads, three green stones. We got 15. Not too bad. But before we finish up, I want to go ahead and open our present box here. You can see there's a bunch of stuff to get, so I might as well receive all. Gave me some extra coins, some extra other stuff. Who really cares? But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Mario Run. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watch this part of the video, make sure you comment to Dead Zebra so I know you've watched it in the video and that you are a Zebra task viewer. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.